Hi, I'm Jasmine, and welcome to Intranet Labs, your U.S. Claremontis experts. In today's video, I'm going to show you one of my favorite Claremontis tools, the Announcements application. This application is so simple yet effective for getting urgent communications out to your staff. It's also perfect for simple reminders and any other type of announcement that you want to make sure your users are seeing, and you can also track red receipts. So this is where we add content into the announcements application, and let's take a look at some of the easy to use features we have here. So first, we've got the abstract, and this is a CK editor that we see everywhere throughout Claramentis. We can do things like include internal or external links and format the font however we'd like. We can also decide when this message is posted and for how long. So this allows you to pre-post these announcements. I recently had a client that needed a way to remind their staff to submit their monthly timesheets. So we went ahead and used the announcements application and set up a monthly reminder at the end of the month that would pop up for their staff. They could click a link and submit their timesheets. It's also great just for reminders, something like a software update or a closure that everyone needs to be aware of. And I've also seen it used in emergency purposes because we have a mobile app. This announcement can be sent to users' mobile phones and users were able to acknowledge if they had uh, successfully exited a building in an emergency situation. You're also provided three style options, depending, I would say, on the urgency of your announcement, a nice banner across the bottom of your platform, that pop-up modal, which is my favorite, or that nice overlay that can sit over top of your menu. We can also track the acknowledgement and red receipts of these announcements. So not only can we see who has viewed it, but we can also make sure the user is actually acknowledging that they've read and understood the announcement. And just like everything else in Claramentis, we have permissions that allows you to target the specific communication to a certain group or role. Uh, this is great for departmental needs, um, maybe we're doing by location. I can also target a specific user if they need a reminder, or perhaps this is going company wide. We can also send this out via email, which is something I really appreciate. Now, we hope your staff are in their Claremontis platform every day, but if they're not, they can receive this important update to their email. It will say exactly what's in that abstract and provide them with a link to come back in and confirm that they've read that important announcement. Well, let's go ahead and try out one of these announcements to see what it looks like from the front end. So you write your announcement, again, formatting it however you need, deciding which style we're choosing. I'm going to pick the modal today. We are going to have acknowledgement required, and we'll send this to everybody. When I add the announcement, as somebody managing these, I get to see the back end of this and be able to track all those views and acknowledgements for each announcement. And then as a staff member, as soon as I go back to my home page, I'm going to be prompted with that pop-up announcement. I'll say, yes, I have read and understood to dismiss that. Now, once I've actually read that and complied with it, it still lives in this list here, so I can go back and review that announcement at any time. Now, this is just one of the communication features we offer in Claramentis. If you'd like to learn more about the other applications or how Claramentis can improve your organization, click the link below to book a discussion call with me and my team. Also, don't forget to hit that subscribe button if you'd like to get updates on any new Claramentis applications and features, as we will be releasing new videos regularly. Thanks for watching.